Lidl brand ambassador Paul Flynn has been on a mission to make the ultimate beef burger for us here on the Today Show. Have a look at this. Who doesn't like a really good burger? And my main ingredient, a brilliant burger made from 100% Irish beef. So what we're going to add in as well is some cheese, you know, a cheeseburger, but also some sour cream. The difference with this burger is that I'm making my favourite caramelised onion chutney. And I'm actually going to make it with some red onions. And this chutney, I would suggest that you actually make more than you need. Keep it in the fridge because it's fantastic with sausages, with steak, on a cheese sandwich for loads of different things. So we're going to start off with these onions that have been sliced. And we're just going to pop them into a large pot. And the thing about this is that there's no oil in the pan. What we're simply going to do is let everything bubble up with some vinegar and sugar and a little bit of garlic. Now the red wine is entirely optional. It will work without using the red wine, no problem. So just a little bit of this. The most important thing when cooking with wine is that it doesn't have to be the expensive stuff. If you're happy enough to drink it, that's the wine you should be using to cook with. So, not much, just a little. It's gonna cook for 15 to 20 minutes. In all honesty, low and slow is the way to go. Leave it bubble away and it'll get lovely and jammy. So now for my burger. So, I have a nice hot pan and I have my lovely Irish burgers, really beautiful meat. What I love about burgers is that you can do almost anything with them and people love them. I mean, there's a real almost burger explosion in terms of like the people don't want fancy food anymore. They like a burger because it's proper comfort food. I mean, good cooking is such an important part of the house, but good, a good burger is a real indulgence, you know? But this is particularly lovely. It's really well seasoned. You don't have to put salt and pepper on this whatsoever. It comes from the best of Irish. I love them. That's what we use at home. We need to get a lovely crust on this, so it's important you do it in a hot pan or else do it underneath the grill. It's an important thing to seal in the juices of the meat when the meat is so nice like this, okay? And the thing about good cooking as well, I don't believe that good cooking should be expensive. I think if you go out and you spend a tenner on your family and you have a really nice dinner afterwards, I think you're the smarter person. Right, so I have my burger buns. You can toast them or warm them or, you know, or not toast them at all. Lovely and fresh. How do you know when the burger is cooked? But really when the juices run clear, that's what you want. But the thing is, once the juices run clear, don't leave it on for too much longer because they will go dry. So these are starting to run clear. So nice and hot. And the lovely meat juices will seep into the bun as well. So now I'm just gonna put the cheese on. I have the sour cream and I have my chutney. See the color? It's really like an onion jam, beautiful color. The thing about this chutney is that it is sweet, so that's where the sour cream comes in. I could be codding myself, but we're going to put a bit of spinach on here just for a bit of salad. It, but it does give a bit of freshness, it does. And you can always add more of anything. I think that burgers are meant to be a little bit messy. I see people eating burgers with a knife and fork and I just think, life's too short. Cut them in half. Cut them, yeah. So look, that's the, what I call the super burger with the lovely caramelised onion relish. Thank you. I even get an applause. Thanks very much. Oh, thank you. Boule bas. Mm. Really lovely. Yeah. Absolutely fabulous. You know, you can't beat good food. It's just what people want. But a good burger, cooked simply, the best of Irish beef. You can't beat it. The blatant disregard for TV presenters being fed in the show. It's going on too long now here, to be honest. <laughs> I have to say, I've got to put in a complaint. Who was one complaint? Oh, Paul, 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 yeah, Paul Flynn, yeah. Mm, okay, yeah. I don't know send where he is, though. Well, he's, if he's making burgers like that in the shop, he should send in supplies for us first <laughs> and then go off and do it somewhere else. <laughs> now, we are running a lovely competition here because we, in conjunction with Lidl, we want you to create a recipe for us and the winner will get a chance to come in and cook live on air with Paul Flynn. Plus, also, they'll win a cookery demonstration class and an overnight stay at Paul's award-winning tannery restaurant. So get those competition entries in. Details are on the screen now. Also take a look at our Facebook page and all of Paul's recipes and pr current promotional offers are available at Lidl.ie.